We have a really gr great news from Magento Adobe team. They've released a new version of Magento Open Source and Magento Commerce. And this is a 2.3.3 edition. And in this video, I would like to show you some highlights from this release. Let's roll the intro. Hello friends, my name is Max Pronko and in this video I would like to share my thoughts and some highlights from the recent release, Magento Open Source release, which happened 8th of uh, October, actually previous week, and I would like to share some uh, news or release notes which are available as part of this release. This Magento 2.3.3 release includes 170 functional fixes for core functionality, as well as 75 security enhancements. Plus, it also includes 200 community contributions from a Magento community who created pull requests with uh, some bug fixes, with functional changes, with documents, and so on. And let's talk about some highlights of this release. First of all, this release includes 75 substantial security enhancements. It means that you shouldn't hold with upgrading to this latest 2.3.3 edition and upgrade your Magento 2 application immediately. Also, all core payment methods such as Afterize.net, Braintree, PayPal and other payment methods are now PSD2 compatible. As you may have heard, starting from September 14th this year, all payment methods should comply with payment standard directive at second edition and there is no exception that your payment method should support this uh, PSD2 or should be compliant with PSD2. This release also includes cross-site scripting uh, fixes and improvements so your website would be more stable and secure in terms of XSS injections. The 2.3.3 release also includes platform improvements. Starting from this version or, or this uh, release, uh, Magento supports PHP 7.3 version. It also supports a Varnish 6.2 version. Also, Zen Framework 2 components were updated to, to its latest active edition. This release also provides some performance improvements. For example, all non-critical CSS uh, files as well as JavaScript libraries were uh, added or moved from uh, top of the page to the bottom and it really improves uh, such pages as category, product and other pages. So you can uh, see the performance improvement on these pages, especially if you are using different custom fonts. Starting from 2.3.3 release, you should be aware that there are some uh, functionality added in order to track admin activity, meaning that all actions like saving operations, uh, visiting different admin pages and other uh, related to admin area operations will be tracked. And for the very first time admin user will be logged in into Magento admin panel, he or she will get a pop-up with a question whether uh, his or her actions uh, can be monitored and data can be sent to Adobe Analytics tool. This is a third party tool which will help to improve uh, further implementations of different functionality. There is also extended GraphQL coverage added into this release for modules such as PayPal, such as gift card, uh, store credit features and others, as well as a new PWA Studio 4.0 has been released with the additional features. This release also brings some backward incompatible changes and you should be aware about these changes if you are using some uh, functionality, core functionality, you would have to check all backward incompatible changes and there is a list of such changes which comes with 2.3.3 edition and I will link this uh, list below this video so you can double check whether you use certain areas of uh, or classes which are deprecated or which were removed with this release. This is all I wanted to share in this video as part of the release announcement. As you can see, Magento team as well as Magento community works hard in order to improve uh, Magento platform. And this release is no exception that it brings uh, additional security as well as performance fixes. I encourage you to update your current version of Magento to the latest Magento 2.3.3 version. Have a look. At Test it before going to production and enjoy this uh, one of the best e-commerce platform in the world. 
Don't forget to subscribe, stay in touch, and I will see you. I will see you in my next video. Bye.